Hello, welcome back. <clears throat> I am showing you this mess. This mess of a bed, mattress, knocked over plants, and plants on boxes. Okay? I'm showing you this mess because this is what my dog did. But I, I'm part of this too because I put these plants on boxes. And so, I have to move them now. I've got dirt on this mattress that I'm going to have to vacuum up and sweep up. And so, basically, we're going to be cleaning up this mess. Don't want bouncy balls in the way. <laughs> this is my green onion plant. It survived through the winter. One of the few of my plants that survived through the winter. Because I brought all these plants in, and I probably shouldn't have. As you can see, it's quite a mess. And I just put them on top of boxes. And that was not a sturdy decision. <laughs> So I'm moving these plants that fell down. The ones that are still good, I'm moving them. Just to get them out of, way, out of the way, because we have this mess to clean. I'm gonna put this plant on top of this box. And this can still be used. All of this dirt, so I'm going to shake the dirt off, move this over, just want to make things look clean again, and then shake the dirt off of this, stack this up higher, and we will try to pick these plants up that fell over. I wonder if they are even alive. I really cannot tell. I don't think so. I think that these are, there's nothing alive growing in these. <laughs> I think they've all died. So it wasn't that bad that they were knocked over because they're not living I don't, plants. I think this is a weed that's dead. <laughs> yeah, the wrong thing grew. Instead of what I planted growing, a weed grew. And there's some more bats down here that I'm picking up. Yeah, these aren't alive either. This is just dirt. Wow. So I guess the, I gotta vacuum this dirt up. It's quite a bit of dirt. I'm going to get the vacuum now. Yeah, that's your mess, Athena. I have to clean up your mess. You made a mess and you couldn't clean it up yourself. So I So I have my vacuum. I'm going to use the Bissell. I'm going to take this box out of the way because I'm not going to use this box anymore. As a matter of fact, I am going to sweep some of this dirt into this box before I vacuum. That way I don't fill up the vacuum bag with dirt in one vacuum. I did get this dirt up, and this dirt will not have to be vacuumed up, and I can just go put that soil back in my yard. Okay. 
Okay, moving the blend out of the way so I can get a little bit of a vacuum in here. I don't know why you don't have to use vacuum, but I just think it helps faster cleaning. A lot of times it can clean the floor faster than sweeping. sheet off and put it in dirty clothes because I don't want to have a bunch of dirt in my dirty clothes so I'm going to lift it up because it's just a mattress and it's not that heavy and I'm going to take this sheet off I'm going to stick this mattress to the side here and my dog nobody uses this bed my dog does sometimes, and that's why this happened. She jumped on the bed, and it slid across the floor, and it knocked all of those boxes over. So I took the bed sheet off of that mattress. Here's the bed sheet. I'm going to put it in the dirty clothes and wash it in the washing machine with the clothes. And the mattress, I picked it up out of the floor. I've got it propped up against the wall. And I'm going to do another vacuum right here on the floor because there's still dirt here. But I want to do a little sweep first. So I've got my broom in my desk pan. I'm doing one little sweep before I vacuum this. As you can see, plenty of dirt. And like I said, I don't want to fill up the vacuum bag all in one vacuum with dirt. I'm going to put this dirt back in my box so I can put the dirt back in my yard. Okay, and then I'm going to vacuum over here to make sure I got all the dirt. <laughs> 